This whole online dating thing doesn't really feel like us. If we do a good job here and I get a date, I'm not your problem anymore. Let's get to work. Bob, the dating website must have matched us together. Maybe we could use this as an opportunity to redo our first date. You know, try it again. We could leave the past in the past. I'd like that. This was a disaster. Take me home. I thought you'd never ask. Bob, I need you. Let's meet at our spot at the beach in an hour. Let's talk it all out. Bob? You have reached a number that has been disconnected or is no longer in service. I realize now the terrible mistake I've made, Maureen. I'm gonna make things right, I promise. Listen, Joe, I gotta thank you again for getting me a job at the nonprofit. Of course, man. We've known each other for, what, 10 years? It'll be nice to get to work together for once. Listen up. I have some good news and some bad news. The nonprofit is closing down. Paperwork's filed, and today is our last day. Wait, really? So do I still have a job? Wait, what's the good news? I may have overstated just how much good news there is. Uh, okay, how much good news is there? None. Now, in order to save face, I'm announcing that we've accomplished our mission and that's why we're closing down. And not because of the whole missing money thing. How can you say that? Our, our mission was to clean up the oceans. Yeah, and basically we did. This was taken today. That's currently floating in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Yeah, you kind of got to pick and choose your battles. Well, what are we supposed to do now? No idea, but I do know that I'm starting my retirement off right. Windsurfing on my friend's private island. Hey man. Look, I'm, I'm sorry about today. I really had no idea. It's all good, man. I actually have a new job lined up. Wait, really? Yeah, my new boss is actually picking me up right now. What's up, Alex? Hop in. Wait, Jordan hired you? For what? He started a new internet company. Got a million dollar loan yesterday. What the hell kind of internet company did you start? Doesn't matter. Any internet company with a catchy name can get as much funding as they want. I'm gonna be rich. <laughs> well, see ya. Wait, 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 wait. I want in. Look, I will consider hiring you on one condition. What? You have to help me beat the Mission GTA where you raid the FBI office. I, I just can't get past that one. Fine, uh, I'll help you with your video game. Get in. Maureen.
Green. I love you. I didn't say it enough when I had you. I got complacent and I'm sorry about that. If you give me another chance, I promise I'll make it right. Bob, what are you doing here? This is kind of a bad time. This is my grand gesture to win you back. That's nice of you and all, but it's time for us to move on and start a new chapter in our lives. How can I start a new chapter without my favorite character? Clever. How long did it take you to come up with that one? Stole it from an online message board. You know, I waited for you that day at the beach and you never showed up. I was lost then. I didn't know what I wanted, but it's so clear to me now. Maureen, this can't be how our story ends. After all, ours is not a love story, but a story about love. Online message board? Online message board. I'm sorry, Bob. It's too late. Spending a winter in Alaska has taught me two things. Never waste good animal fat and I need you. Hold that thought. Exactly a jewelry aficionado, but it's nice. Trust me, Sophia's gonna love it. Well, this is all she's been asking for for weeks. Oh, that's great. Come by tomorrow and pick it up. I still have to finish the engraving. Sure. Before you go, and I hate to ask you to do this, but do you mind mailing this package for me? Are you serious? Yeah, it's just some jewelry that I need shipped out today. But I'm swamped around here. You wouldn't mind, would you? I don't know, I'm also pretty busy today. Come on, it's five minutes out of your way. Yeah, but it's it's not really my thing. What's not your thing, helping people? Exactly. So you're really not gonna do me a favor here? Well, listen, if I help you, then I gotta help everyone who asks, and that's just not sustainable. You know what I mean? No, I, I don't. <sighs> Whatever, just come by tomorrow and pick up the necklace, all right? So what do I owe you for it? Uh, it's, uh, um, 200. Wow, okay. Seems like you might have some time to go ship out that package, huh? Please leave. Right. So how's the new job with Jordan? First day is tomorrow. That'll be interesting. I'm so excited for our anniversary. Me too. You got that link I accidentally sent to the necklace I want, right? Don't worry. I got it all figured out. Keep in mind, your friend Ryan didn't get his girlfriend that necklace, and now his cousin is his plus one to a wedding. And the necklace is only $50. Wait, don't you mean $200? No, they're only 50 bucks. Are you sure about that? Yeah, it says it right there on her website. 50 bucks. Son of a... Do you want to do something? Nah, I'm good. Do you want to get some food or something? I'm kind of hungry. I'm actually doing this new intermittent fasting cleanse. I only eat between 2 and 2.30 a.m. Oh, okay. Ooh, gotta take this. Dorinda, this is a total disaster. You know, I'm just seeing Larry to make Bob jealous. But my God, I had no idea how much of a pain he would be. What? I gotta go. Larry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it like that. You're only with me to get back at Bob? Come on, Larry. This can't be a total shock. So what? I'm just a pretty face to you? Because that's fine. I can be that guy. So, Jordan, what exactly is it we do here? All right, all right. So, 
we invest enough money to fund the day-to-day -day operations. Then we get three friends each to invest their money. They get more friends to invest their own money. And eventually, after a little bit of time, a little bit of luck, we get enough money to buy a yacht. Okay, but do we have like a product or something? How do we actually make money? What do you mean? Hey Jordan, I was looking through your books and I found a lot of discrepancies. I'm sure I could clear up any questions you have. Okay, what's this company credit card charge for $1,200 on facialbook.com? Don't you mean Facebook? I wish. Look, don't, don't look too deep into that. Just write business expense and move on. I, I just want to be clear. You are aware that we're running a pyramid scheme here, right? Oh yeah, yeah, very much so. And you're also aware that Bernie Madoff is currently serving a 150 year sentence at a supermax for exactly what we're doing here. Hey, it'll be fun while it lasts, right? All right, now why don't you kids go run and take your lunch break? We're probably going to jail, right? Oh, we're definitely going to jail. All right, time to see if I can get some matching jet skis for my yacht. Joe? What are you doing here? The necklace isn't ready yet. I think I know what you did. Huh? You overcharged me for Sophia's necklace. Probably because I wouldn't ship your package for you. Are you seriously accusing me of trying to rip you off? Well, why did my necklace cost so much more than the others? Well, first of all, yours was engraved. Engraving isn't worth 200 bucks. You know, you've got some nerve coming over here and hurling ridiculous accusations at me. Look, my point is, I don't think I should be overcharged just because I'm a bad person. Well, if you want to turn things around and become a good person, I do need another package shipped. Oh no, I, I didn't mean it like that. No, I know I'm a bad person and I'm pretty much okay with it. You have issues. You know that, right? Trust me, there's a team of psychologists having a field day with me. Why don't you just leave? Oh, so when do I pick up the necklace? I said get out. Do I at least get a refund? Bob, what are you doing here? Larry, as is the practice, when a man steals another man's woman, I am here to confront you. What's your deal? Maureen and I aren't done. Not yet, at least. Bob, I understand that you're just looking for someone to blame. But the truth is, you've got no one to blame but yourself. The hell are you talking about? You made a huge mistake not going after Maureen when you had the chance. And I capitalized on that mistake. You know what? You're right. It's all my fault. As long as you're moping, you want to mop? Sure, what the hell? Look, Bob, it's not too late to save your marriage with Maureen. How do you figure? Because the entire time I was with her, all she could talk about was you. Really? I mean, good, good. You still have a chance, Bob. That's more than most guys would get. Don't mess it up again. You're right. It's time to save my marriage. After a second coat. Where's Jordan? No idea. Oh my God. What do we do? You know, there's only one thing to do at a time like this. Wipe this room down for fingerprints, clear our names off the hard drives, and get the hell out of here. Right. Okay, I've got your anniversary present here. I'm so excited. Okay, but before I show you, I have to tell you, there was a mix up with your first gift and I kind of lost it. But I think I've got something even better here. Well, let's see it. 
Now, here's a box of tissues, because I do expect there to be tears. Just show me the gift. Right. See, my original gift was that necklace you wanted, but for reasons I won't get into, we can never shop with Becky again. Anyway, then I had the idea to put my drawing skills to use. What do you think? I, uh, it is great. Just kidding. We're going to Hawaii. Oh, thank God. You know, I don't say this enough, but I truly love credit cards. This is so exciting. I've never been to Hawaii before. Well, everything's all planned out. Wait till you see our hotel. All right, we're ready when you are. Yep, just waiting on two more people. Also headed to the airport. Goodness, Joe, Sophia! Uh, hi guys. I, I guess you're back together now. We worked it all out. Turns out I was the problem. Who knew? What are the odds we'd end up in the same taxi together, huh? With my luck? Pretty good. Where are you guys headed anyway? We're on our way to a second honeymoon in Hawaii. How about you two? Yep, Hawaii. Where are you staying? The Marriott. No kidding, us too. Hear me out. You two and us, double date every night. Oh, we're just gonna have a ball. <laughs>